picture Jesus standing in front of the, one of the gates into Jerusalem. I don't know if that's where he was, but I'm just imagining it because uh, I like to use object lessons. So, I'm, and I know Jesus also used parables and illustrations. So I'm imagining he's standing there and he points to a gate and he says, "Use the narrow gate." And everybody's like, "What?" Because that's not what he was talking about. And so maybe they thought he was saying, "We're, we're going to go inside to Mechabed's and get a falafel burger." I don't know what all the crowd thought, but he just says, "Choose a narrow gate." He said, because the wide gate is the path to destruction. Every, maybe so everybody's like, uh, what? Big gate, scary, I don't understand. And uh, so, but he continues to explain that uh, the, the kingdom of heaven, the, the, the way to righteousness is through the narrow gate. It's not, it's not a path everybody finds. Uh, in fact, he even says that few people will find the narrow gate into eternal life. And that many people will find the, the wide gate the huge gate into eternal destruction and if you're a Christ follower as I ex expect you are then you've chosen the narrow gate just like I have as a Christian if you're not then and you find yourself looking at this video right now my encouragement to you is for your own sake choose the narrow gate you're, you're going through the wide one and there's nothing at the end of that wide gate except eternal destruction and in hell and you don't want that so choose the narrow gate. Find Jesus. And I know that might sound really religious to you or whatever. I'm just like some church guy. and uh, But the truth is, I follow Jesus. And he's the way, the truth, and the life. And he has so much for you, so find him. For you Christ followers, you know somebody who hasn't gone through the narrow gate. So it's your job and it's my job as Christians to let people who don't know him see him in our lives. So man dare yourself today to go tell somebody about Jesus to point out the narrow gate like Jesus said and say go that way take the narrow gate the the big one while it might look big and shiny and pretty is really horrible on the other side take the narrow gate into the truth of who Jesus is his love for you and uh, if you've done it keep living it if you haven't yet choose it and if you are a Christ follower and you know somebody who isn't and you probably do then take the challenge today and go tell somebody about him. Point to the narrow gate and say, go that way. That's where the life is.